Get on the way! Welcome to this player golf test. So we're taking a look at Olivier Cham. The 20-year-old center mid is 70 overall. So some very solid stats from the start. You guys have requested this player quite a bit. Glad to finally get around to testing him. But he's 5 foot 11, right foot, high high work rates, three star weak foot, and two star skill moves. So from the start, physically some good pace. The strength is pretty solid. Also, uh, pretty high stamina for a 70 overall player. Then good ball control, dribbling, passing, shot power, and stand tackle are not too bad either. Bit low in the general marking, but very really like that. Uh, High stand tackle, of course, will come in handy in that middle of the pitch, being able to uh, win that ball with that strength and, you know, try back with that pace, stamina, of course, with that tackling ability will be a really good combination there defensively uh, and being a two-way type of midfielder. But plus two at the end of that first season, some good improvements here and there physically and technically getting a lot of improvement, really. Uh, you can see some good steady improvement again. Plus four is really nice to see. Ball control, dribbling, passing, getting the bulk of the improvement. Of course, finishing is an area that improves, improves quite a bit for center mids along with that stand tackle. I'd love to see that high stand tackle really cements himself as a two-way midfielder now um, with that ball control dribbly passing and stand tackle all being in that dark green really nice to see that there physically looking pretty solid as well stamina uh, gets a huge boost here as he's hitting this 81 overall age 24 with that pretty high stamina and the mental stats are not too bad either the interceptions are pretty solid aggression is not too bad really coming handy again when he's getting into those tackles in the midfield being a two-way type of player which he really was for me um, and he felt pretty good on the ball doesn't have the highest agility, but the dribbling is very nice. You can see him taking a shot on goal there eventually. Uh, I think he's kind of a, an ideal two-way box-to-box midfielder, in my opinion. He can get those interceptions on occasion, like you can see in that highlight. Love to see that type of play from any midfielder being able to track back and do some two-way play. And, of course, the passing is nice. That long pass here, being able to stretch the defense out on that wing is always good to see. So, again, very solid player. Getting involved in that build-up play. Uh, felt really nice on the ball because of that high dribbling. Doesn't have the, the, high, the, best, the agility and balance are not the best, but just had that strength, so in the midfield, you can you probably want to hit that LT quite a bit, be able to hold off those defenders. Uh, and you can really see it in some of the other highlights in the future as well, just seeing more of that build up play, getting into those tackles as well. I uh, love to see that. And of course, with that tackle, he actually creates an opportunity and grabs himself an assist, also. So good to see that type of play, being able to create uh, you know those opportunities with his two way play, with not only his tackling, but eventually playing a perfect pass there. You can see him again tracking back with that pace, with that strength and tackling ability, being able to win that ball back there. As you can see it again here in this highlight as well. Uh, so can really, again, um, be an ideal box-to-box -box midfielder for you guys. And you see him getting forward, getting forward a little bit as well. Because, again, finishing uh, grew quite a bit for him. And he can end up you know scoring some of those chances he does have in front of goal, such as this one. So pretty nice finish here when he's in front of that net. So we'll see him end up capping out this 84 overall at age 25. Again, some very good stats all around. Uh, the, the, the passing... Is absolutely wonderful here. The strength and stamina have grown quite a bit. Good balance again, so he's going to feel pretty nice on the ball. Interceptions and vision did get some good growth, but ball control, dribbling, passing, uh, finishing, stand tackle, and long shots really took the bulk of the improvement there in those technical stats. So again, a lovely player, very well-rounded, an ideal box-to-box -box midfielder. And we'll take a look at his specialty, see he's picked up as well if he has picked up any. Uh, but we'll see again, five foot eleven, so decent height there with that engine specialty again, pretty high stamina, and he can slots a few other positions as well. 80 as a center forward, 82 as a cam even. 79 as a right mid, left mid, 80 as a CDM. His, his marking is pretty low. Uh, if it wasn't for his marking being so low, he'd definitely be higher rated as a CDM and maybe step in as a center back for you also. But you'll take a look at those final stats again as you wrap out this video. Uh, so decent sprint speed and acceleration. High balance. 82 is going to feel good on that ball again. 85 strength, 86 stamina. Decent mental stats all around. Interceptions and vision being pretty good. 89 ball control, 84 dribbling, 73 finishing is pretty solid, but 89 long pass, 87 short pass, the 91 stand tackle, and 78 long shots. So again, a very ideal box-to-box -box midfielder with solid pace, good balance, high stamina, high strength as well, and of course, that tackling ability, dribbling, uh, ball control, and passing as well. So you'll, you'll be able to be an, a just top-notch box-to-box -box midfielder. A really big recommendation here, guys. I definitely would take a look at him with that. Thanks for tuning in, guys. I'll be signing out now, and I'll catch you guys later.